Well, good morning. Thursday, 17th of October. And we are moored up outside the tunnel, Ashworth Tunnel, near Talibont, in the middle of nowhere, but very near the river. The boats have been leaning all night and I've been falling around. Now we know why, look at that lean. So um, yeah, we're gonna get going soon. It's about half past nine in the morning, the sun is out. There's also a little bit of light rain, but uh, no worries. And I'm gonna show you the view across to the river. This is the entrance to Ashworth Tunnel. We went through last night in the pouring rain. It rained all day yesterday. But today, it's a lovely day. And look at this view here. See if I can show you it closer. It's very muddy. But uh, look at that. These are cars. We've just walked through here. We can get to to the river itself. Here we go. There we go. In the mist and the rain. Hopefully it's going to clear up. So yeah, we'll be setting off soon and I'll take you on our adventure. I'm going to stop filming now because it is quite rainy as you can see but it's a beautiful day and uh, we're looking forward to getting going see you later So this is day six on our way to land Gatok or to Gilwern. Got some locks to do. I'll try and film the locks as I didn't film them before. But the sun is around. It's cloudy, but it's dry. And we've pretty much dried from yesterday, which was horrendous. But, this, but the lovely thing about today is with that storm having gone, we've got beautiful clear views across to the hills and if I bring you across there more beautiful wooded countryside I think the River Usk is down there somewhere so this will probably be the busiest day of filming certainly for a couple of days just because the weather is so much better I don't want like getting the camera wet but yeah Welcome aboard folks on the Monmouth Monmouthshire Bracken Canal.
Okay, so we're at a lock. Haven't filmed many locks. Margaret and Josh have gone down there to fill the next lock. And we are here. There's the boat. We're just waiting for this lock to fill up. There's the water gushing in. Waiting for the water to fill up. There's a friendly Locky. He's been helping us today. This is top lock.
So we're back with the lockies. They're going to open the next lock. So we're through the lock and Jim should be coming out here any minute. Friendly Lockies, where we be without the Lockie Angels? Another lock. Lovely little place. Country craft narrow boats. little lock keeper's house. Welsh honey.
countrycraftnarrowboats.com Amazing. Absolutely beautiful. Well, we had a rain shower at the last lock, but now the sun has come out and we can see the Bracken beacons. So I thought I'd do a bit more filming. Wouldn't be Wales if it wasn't raining. Well, lunchtime stop, the rain finished after we'd done the locks. Yeah, I just had a pasty for my lunch. Very nice it was too. But we have had a bit of a drama in that the uh, one of the main toilets, uh, the red light, the dreaded red lights come on. That means it needs a pump out. And you've only got about another six flushes. So I've just been spending the last 20 minutes trying to find a mobile signal but I found marina not far from here and they'll pump out so we'll have a toilet working again which is handy when there's five of you on the boat one toilet doesn't really uh, doesn't really do it if you know what I mean especially at night so uh, we're gonna head off go to beacon boats I think they're called beacons moorings or beacons boats and um, yeah we're gonna get it pumped out so uh, I might film a little bit of that you never know for those that are interested in how a toilet is pumped out don't worry it's not messy see you in a moment well this is actually where we're moored up it's a little bit of sunshine in the way we we're not going to complain about that today, after yesterday. Yeah, so this is where we're moored up. A couple of hopeful ducks. You think they're going to get fed? They might get something. And just down here, I don't know if you can hear it. That's the river down there, the Usk, that follows the canal in the valley. And yes, we are in a lovely little place. Not too far away from civilization, far enough to uh, feel like you're out on your own. So, we'll see you at the pump out experience later.
just filming a little bit of Sugarloaf Mountain but you might see it again in a minute um, just literally went behind those trees might see it in a minute Margaret and Josh driving the boat you might get to see Sugarloaf just here just on the other side of this mountain uh, there's a tree in the way I think just on the behind the trees there Sugarloaf there's Sugarloaf there hopefully you're getting to see some of that beautiful shines out again So a bit of an update on the toilet situation. As you know, um, our toilet was a uh, red light of doom. It, it was full, we need to get it emptied. We did go to Brecon Park, sorry, Beacon Park boats in Langatok, and they were very helpful. Um, did the pump out, great people. Thank you very much. I'll put a link in the uh, description below. They're fantastic people, great boats they've got as well. However, once we left and one of us went to use the loo, we realised that we have got two loos and they'd pumped out the one that didn't need pumping out. Our mistake, we never told them which one it was. They went for the one on the back and it was the one on the front. So we still had the red light of doom. Luckily, as we came into Gilwern, we went past Castle Narrowboats and a lovely bloke there did do us a pump out. It was about five o'clock, 5.30, it was almost dark. He was almost going home and he did our pump. So thank you to Castle Narrow Boats. I'll put you also in there. Both great companies, fully recommend them. And it got us out of a pickle. We then had enough of the day and we moored up in Gilwern. And uh, yeah, it was an eventful uh, last hour or so, um, but all sorted in the end. And uh, yeah, we now had two lovely clean toilets. Anyway, that's enough toilet talk for one day. I'll leave it there. Uh, vlog number six, the penultimate vlog, or is it seven? I can't remember. Uh, I'll put it on the screen. We'll be with you shortly. So thanks again for watching. All the very best, and I'll see you for another vlog very soon. Bye for now. Bye bye.